Hey guys and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be filming an end of summer haul as you can see by the title. It feels like donkey's years since I filmed a haul on this channel. I feel like I used to do them quite often and I think I just haven't done one in a while because I have been shopping obviously like I'm not not gonna shop but um I haven't been buying as much so this is a lot of stuff that I've compiled over the past couple of months I'd like to say and yeah I'm excited to show it to you all today. So I'm gonna start with accessories first because if you know me you know I love a good accessory. I wear them all the time. You will pretty much never see me without jewellery on and the first few items have very kindly been sent to me by Daniel Wellington. They were kind enough to send me two watches and a cuff and at the moment Daniel Wellington actually have an end of summer campaign on. That means if you buy a watch then you get 50% off a cuff like this and you can also use my code which is Lydia Violetta for a further 15% off as well on top of that which is amazing. So the first watch they were kind enough to send me is this white one here and this is the petite 32 millimeter Bondi watch in silver and black and then the cuff I'm wearing here just says Daniel Wellington on it. This is a try and haul so I will do close-ups of these items anyway but yeah it just says Daniel Wellington and it's silver and this is in size small and it just looks like that around the back and then I also have this watch as well which just looks like this it's just a black one and this is the petite 28 millimeter Ashfield watch in silver and black and yeah I am so obsessed with these look how classy they all look they are literally beautiful and the great thing about Daniel Wellington watches as well is that all of the straps are interchangeable so I have a white strap on this one and a black one on this one but you can buy other straps and change them up to match your outfits or to match your mood etc etc and it saves you buying a whole new watch which is so good and they have loads of different styles on their website as well as you can see this is just two of the ones they have I will put the link to Daniel Wellington's website in the description along with my discount code and I would really recommend going and checking them out especially as they've got that amazing deal on right now as well for the end of summer and maybe get yourself a watch for back to school. I really recommend wearing a watch to school, they're so convenient. Okay, I also then have some new earrings because I wear earrings all the time, I feel like earrings are my thing and actually I'll show you the ones I have on right now because these are new as well. These are just some hoops from H&M and they're so cool because they're like two hoops in one and they're quite thick but they're a nice size and yeah those were from H&M and also from H&M I have these earrings which are silver as well and these are longer earrings as you can see kind of hoops as well i think i have a bit of an obsession with silver hoops i own so many of them but yeah you just have two circles like that with this little like dangly ball thing <laughs> going through them and i think these look so cool and funky and yeah i didn't realize how good h&m jewelry was i got so many nice pairs of earrings from there and yeah also from h&m while we're on the topic i bought myself a hat i have never been a hat person i pretty much never wear hats but i saw this one and i was like you know what i might give it a go so it's just this white cap and I still don't know if I really suit them or not. I don't want to pull it fully down my head because I do have a full face of makeup on and this is a white hat. So yeah, let me know what you think. Um, I wore it out the other day and I'm not gonna lie, I do feel quite self-conscious in it. I feel like I look like I'm about to play golf. So I don't know, but I do feel like it also is a vibe. So especially with the silver jewelry. <gasps> look how well that goes with the watch actually. That's a vibe. Next I bought some new silver hoop earrings although these aren't new at all because you if you watch my vlogs you will have known that I wear these hoops all the time they're from uh, Topshop and they're just like the perfect size the perfect kind of width and ev width, width and everything but the other ones that I had had 
rusted and kind of tarnished or whatever it is and they didn't look as great anymore and they, these are only a fiver so I thought you know what I'll pick myself up some new ones while I was in Topshop and yeah I just love these as well they also have the most convenient fastening I don't know if you can see that but they just flick down like that which is great because so many hoops I own have those little like sticks that you have to like feed through your ear and honestly I just it hurts <laughs> and I always injure myself with them so these are the most convenient to put in. I've just realised I've bought a lot of white and silver things this month because the next item I have to show you are a white pair of sandals. These are from ASOS and I bought these for summer in the city to wear because I thought they were a really nice manageable height and the white went with my outfit. I'll show you the other bits of my outfit later on in this haul so you can piece it together in your mind. But yeah, these did me well. Not gonna lie, by the end of the day my feet were still hurting but definitely not as much as they would have in heels that were higher than this. And yeah, they just look like this. Excuse how dirty they are. Oh my god, that's embarrassing. But yeah, just white kind of shiny heels i really like the shape of the actual heel as well it's not just straight down it's got a nice angle to it so lastly for accessories i picked up a bum bag recently because uh i went to splendor festival and i feel like bum bags are such a classic festival item and not gonna lie i see why because they are so convenient to put your stuff in and not have to hold anything so this one is from boohoo and i don't know how well you can see that on camera but it's a really nice kind of chevron pattern lots of the ones i saw were either leather or they were quite a shiny fake leather but this one is quite matte and it's quite neutral for your outfit so yeah okay now actually moving on to clothes the first item I have to show you is probably my favorite thing that I have bought recently and it is this leopard print jumpsuit I don't know how well you're gonna be able to see that on camera but I will have a try on clip anyway so you'll see it in that and this is from New Look but it's one of the brands that they stock at New Look it's AX Paris and oh my god I'm literally obsessed with this um I was so tentative to buy leopard print I was always in the mindset that it was too bold and like people would look at you funny but honestly when I have it on I love the way that it looks and this is such a flattering play suit as well did I say jumpsuit earlier I meant play suit um, because it cinches you in at the waist really nicely I know it doesn't look like it now and the shorts are quite long as well they cover your bum for me so many play suits never ever cover my bum but these ones do which is so nice next I have a couple bits from I saw it first and I've never shopped on I saw it first before at all but Lizzie always gets some really nice bits from there so I thought I'd give it a go and the first item I have from there is a pair of black flared trousers after summer in the city there was an after party for creators and it was Mamma Mia themed so I thought to myself I've got to wear flares like this is a great excuse to wear flares because if you know me you know I love that kind of style anyway so yeah this is just a black pair of flares I feel like I've said the word flares so many times now um but yeah they're super nice and high-waisted as well they go up really high and yeah they're really flattering on your bum and the quality of them is actually amazing believe it or not I only got these for six quid um I think they were on sale anyway and then I think there was a code on top of that so I ended up getting them for six quid and the quality of these is amazing like they're really like a thick crepe material not what I expected at all for the price that I paid but I'm very very happy with these next I need to show these two items together really because I do wear them together and the first one is this black bralette also from I saw it first and it just looks like this you won't be able to see it very well when I'm holding up like this and it's got this really nice design where there's that kind of bit of string or whatever it is over your boob at the front and this just looks really nice I got this in a size 10 it is a little bit big for me but once again with some boob tape it just it does stay down and I was wearing that with this bodysuit which is all mesh 
and flowers. It doesn't show up very well on camera once again, but trust me in the try on clip, as you will see, the combination of those two things looks amazing. And yeah, I wore this for Saturday in Summer in the City and it is honestly one of the prettiest things I own, I think. It just zips up all the way at the back like that and it's a bodysuit at the bottom. And yeah, I was quite out my comfort zone with mesh. I'd never worn it before, but on you it looks so pretty and I don't think this was too expensive either. Sometimes mesh things can be quite pricey but I don't think this one was too bad. I also saw the other day that they have it in a white which looks equally gorgeous and they have a white bralette so that could also be a great combination if you're looking for something like this. Next we have another leopard print thing and this is a bandeau from Topshop. I, you might have seen my Instagram post in this. I wore this to Splendour Festival and I love this so much. It's literally a perfect bandeau. It's the perfect size. It's the perfect stretchiness, the perfect material. Guaranteed it was about £9 I think and last time I checked I don't think they had it in stock but I will check again when I'm doing the links for this video and yeah I love this so much and as you can tell I am starting to get into leopard print a lot. I feel like I'm quite late to the bandwagon but yeah really really like this and would really recommend it as well. Then we have a, another bandeau and this one is from Urban Outfitters and this never shows up very well on camera at all but it's this really sparkly gold bandeau. It's just black and it's got gold glitter uh, throughout all of it and once again this is a really nice bandeau in the sense that it's a really nice stretchy material and size. So many bandeaus I try on, like I tried on a bikini this morning, it was literally just a slither like that across my boobs but these ones properly cover it without being too covering if you know what I mean. Also from Urban Outfitters and also glittery <laughs> I got this top which honestly sheds everywhere so I'm going to be covered in glitter after holding this up but it's just this little cami top in this silver colour. It's so 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 cute but as I said it does shed everywhere. It's almost actually got a bit of a blue tint to it if you know what I mean. I wore this with the uh, black flares to the Mamma Mia party and I think that was a really great combination actually because I feel like this does look very Mamma Mia-esque and yeah it's just got a zip down the side like that and it's kind of floaty. It's tight on your boobs but then that bit at the bottom there is quite floaty. The next top is also very out there and this is this rainbow top from TK Maxx actually but it's the brand spotted <laughs> um it looks a bit weird on camera because these bits tie up at the front so the try on clip will be a lot better of a representation of this but I love this top so much I always feel so happy when I wear it because it's just so funky and bright so yeah I think this was around 14 pounds I think but it is from TK Maxx so uh I don't know if I'll be able to find it on the website or not, but I'll have a look on that brand's website and see if I can link that. But yeah, this once again looks really nice with denim shorts and things like that. Speaking of denim shorts, I also bought some denim shorts recently from ASOS and these are just a mum style jeans with a kind of frayed ripped bottom. And what I love about these is they're high waisted, but they still cover all my bum. I have such a problem with shorts where I find it really difficult for them to all cover my bum because I really don't like that style where it shows like the bottom of your bum cheeks or whatever. Um, so yeah, I really like these. They're a really good size. I think I got them in size 10 and these were from the brand Weekday on ASOS. Next, I have another pair of shorts. These are also from ASOS and they are ASOS own brand. And these are just this navy striped pair of shorts. These are so comfy to wear. They're a kind of jersey stretchy material so they were perfect for traveling when I went on holiday and yeah these just look really pretty with a white top, some white trainers, something like that. They've been great in the summer and yeah. Next is a real basic really and it's just this black a uh, long sleeve top from Pretty Little Thing. I had one of these before but when I got my hair dyed uh, it got bleach on it and it went really funny so I bought another one because they are so comfy and 
just convenient to wear they just sit nicely on your body if that makes sense they're really flattering and i bought this because obviously soon it is the end of summer soon we are going back to school so these are always great things to wear to sick form when the weather gets a little bit colder and obviously it goes with so much as well the last two items are items that you have definitely seen before if you follow me on Instagram or you've watched any of my vlogs they are two trousers that I've been wearing non-stop uh, for the past couple of months and the first one is this stripy pair of culottes from Pretty Little Thing I actually bought these on ASOS but obviously they are Pretty Little Thing and these are so funky I think as you can see I'm quite obsessed with colorful stripes I think they look so cool so yeah these ones have been a staple and lastly we have another pair of culottes. These are from the brand Bershka, but I bought them on ASOS once again. I actually love Bershka's clothing so much. Um, I think all of it is so funky and cool. And I love these because they are so comfy. They are like the material of joggers, but in a culotte form. So it's more socially acceptable to wear them out all the time. And they have a really nice tie waist at the top here. And then down the side, there is a big slit like that, which is so nice. And it looks so cool actually, because it doesn't go up too high. It kind of goes up to where your knee is. So you can just see your calf. And yeah, these are so flattering on the bum and everything like that. So been loving those and I feel like they're thick enough to wear in winter as well which is great so yeah that was everything that I had to show you in this end of summer haul I really hope that you enjoyed this and as usual I will link everything down below in the description that I can find so you can go and check it out yourself and also while you're down there definitely make sure to check out Daniel Wellington's end of summer campaign because I know you guys would definitely love their products as much as I do so while you're still here make sure to like subscribe and follow my social media which will be linked down below in the description bye guys